Hey guys, welcome back. I'm going to do just the Trinity knot again, but slower and better. This should be the definitive how to tie a Trinity knot video. I'm going to undo it here so you can see kind of the reverse steps. I feel like that's important to see what direction everything goes in and how many different moves there are. And then we're going to do it. So here we go. This is a little little end knot, which means that the knot's tied with a little end, which is on my right side. The left side is the big end. Here we go. Get it to the right height, put the big end on your belly button like the way you like it, pinch it off, and then go over and up through the front. Okay? Now go around the left side, the spiral side, I'm going to call it, like this, around the back and up the right side, and then through the back. This is a Windsor beginning. You should be familiar with this if you tie ties very often. Keep it on the right side and go up, I mean go over the front create your flat front piece. This is the beginning. Go through the back. Okay, now you're going to go like, like what I'm doing right now. You're going to go through the bottom, but you're going to go through this. So loosen it up a bit and then weave it through. Don't be shy. Use your fingers. All right. You can tighten it up a little bit. And now you're going to go around the back like this. And you're going to go through here and up toward this direction. So come get this with your hand, loosen it up a little bit, and then stick that through. Use your fingers to kind of weave, pull it out. I like to keep it loose. I like a loose trinity. I think it looks great. But you can also tighten it. Then it makes it a lot tighter and smaller. I like it big because it's easier to see. It's, you know, look at that. Perfect. Now I'm going to come back and do it with the stripe tie, see if we can work some magic. S stick around. OK, ready? I got this stripe tie. I'm not saying this outfit matches, although it's actually not so bad. I really want just the element of the stripes to happen. So let's try again. Once again, little end here on my side. Pinch off your, 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 your size nicely. Up through the back and spiral side to the left. Through the back and up the right side. Right side across the middle up the back and now we're going to do our first weave we're going through here so we're going to go through the middle now right now don't worry about getting the stripes to work right now because it's too early keep it very loose though so very loose here I'm going to go around the back and come up through the very last loop okay now you can see now it's time to tighten everything so you pull on the top to tighten the bottom okay you pull on the back of this to tighten the top and then you pull on this to tighten that side. So actually, look at that. That's like a spiral. The gold, see the gold spirals around? That's pretty cool. But we kind of want to tighten it a little bit differently. So maybe we want to anti-tighten a bit here. Okay. Untighten, if you will. So I'm just going to pull it back a little bit and see what I can do. Hmm. We want to pull this one in. See, this is kind of a trial and error kind of a operation. You do a lot of tightening. You do a lot of pulling. You try to get it just right. And it looks like I just kind of got it goofed. Well, there we go. Look at that. Just, so that's pretty perfect. Now, in this case, it depends on your height. depends on the length of your tie. I mean, what point in the pattern you fall in. Every tie will be different. But... I got it so I have a, an orange ring around the center point. So that's pretty cool. I got like a triangle here and a ring around it. See, it's a little off center, but it's the tightening that does it, you know. Uh, now, you can alternatively get all the orange arrows if you get it lined up a little bit differently. You get all the orange arrows pointing in. So then you get like a starburst going out, but I have a triangle. Both are cool and both definitely demand a lot of attention. You can see this is much more obviously like a special knot than with the white tie. That's the beauty of the Trinity. It could be kind of more low key or more up played. Check it out. So thanks for watching. I hope this is uh, even easier to understand than my last ones were. Thanks for watching. Dress for success.